morning I just realized that it's two o'clock and I haven't actually filmed anything for vlogmas because I've been too busy filming for my regular channel which is still this channel but you know what I mean I've been filming real videos not vlogs so I filmed a graphic novel recommendation because you guys have been asking for that so that will be up sometime soon and then I also have two hauls that I need to film because I went to the thrift store again and also I've been sent a couple stuff from publishers so I'm going to film that but again if you guys have any suggestions or requests for me to film please let me know down below i would love to hear them but i went to go walk dixie again this morning so here's a cute little clip of me walking her it's not that cute it's just me walking her also where i live is going into lockdown tomorrow so vlogmas is about to get even more boring than it has been because i literally cannot leave my home but like I said, it's 2 o'clock now, I'm gonna go film some more videos, and then I have to go see the animals again soon to let Dixie go pee outside. Oh, it's also the first day of Cramathon, so that's super exciting. I've been over on the Cramathon Twitter, just kind of saying hi to everybody. So the Twitter is at Cramathon if you want to go check it out. But Cramathon is going on from today, December 20th, until January 2nd. So by the time you see this video, it's probably like December 26th. So you guys can still join if you want. My least favorite part of getting new books is that you have to like rearrange your whole shelf because nothing fits anymore. So down there, literally nothing fits I just keep stacking things in front of things and then there's all these holes in there but they don't fit those books because like those are all my series kind of things and those are like standalone ones and it's just a lot of work that I don't want to do and those are books that I've actually read but there's also books that I haven't read in there so basically the moral of my story is that I need to reorganize my shelves but I am way too lazy to actually reorganize my shelves and I have way too many because I only have three here but then I also have all of that I think there's three there. Yeah, three there. All of those are my audiobooks. And then I also have a shelf over there too. So again, moral of the story, I have too many books and I probably should get rid of some, but I'm too lazy to go through them. So I'm not gonna do that. There's two. Yes. It's from Rain Coast. Sorry, it's from Rain Coast. <gasps> Is that one you wanted? Yes. Oh. Is that one you wanted? Yes. Oh. And this one we don't know. This is from Amazon. I need a knife. From Amazon? What are is it? This is a gift note from Taylor. Merry Christmas, Jay. I really enjoyed this one, so I hope you enjoy it too. It's now three o'clock and I filmed the graphic novel video and one of the hauls, but I only have four books from publishers. So I usually only film haul videos with five books just because like it makes it feel like it's, you know, even, even though it's not an even number, if that makes any sense. Five just feels like a good number, okay? So I'm not going to be filming another haul video until I get one more book from a publisher or a gift or something you know what I mean. But I wanted to come on here and tell you guys of the goof that I made today. So I have fake nails. You all know that. You saw it on Vlogmas. They're like press on nails, but they were all coming off. So I decided with my little brain, I'm going to be smart and I'm going to glue them back on with the nail glue that I bought. So I glued them all back on and then I realized I glued this on upside down. So that's the thing that happened except you can't really tell unless like I point it out or if like it actually focuses you can tell that it has like a little chip at the top I think it's hilarious though because it doesn't actually like sit properly on the nail because it's upside down so I just thought that was a funny story that I should share and you all know now that my nail is fucked but I am going to go host some sprints on Cramathon I'm currently reading the woman outside my door by Rachel Ryan. It's about a woman who just lost her mother and then her son starts saying that he is being visited by new granny which is a woman which is like an old lady that he met in the woods who wants to be his granny and it's like her trying to deal with that and whether or not he's just playing like an imaginary game in order to grieve his grandmother who just passed away or if there's actually like a woman who's like 
fucking with her son. And it's like the story of that, but 91 pages in, it's all right so far. But yeah, those are the plans for the day now. I'm just going to be reading because I can't film anything else because I am uninspired and have no idea what to film. So we're just gonna read and then I'm gonna go see the dog and the other animals and feed them and all that jazz, so. Yeah, super boring vlog day. like I said. <laughs> I chose my daddy's beer. I picked Zodiac because I thought it looked cool and it's like an all black can. So I was like, yeah, we need it. And then I chose the best one in the whole store and it is called Sparkle Puff. And it has a laser shooting rainbow kitty cat. And I thought it looked good. He doesn't think it'll taste good. You did say that. You said no. that'll be interesting. That doesn't mean it won't taste good. It's gonna be fruity. That's just peaches. You're fruity, so it works out. There you go. You're welcome. I already said right there. Oh, and then we also got him these ones, bone shakers, because his boyfriend drinks them, so he loves them. <laughs> right? Shout out to Kevin. Say goodbye. Goodbye, Vlogmas. Bye, Vlogmas. <laughs> <laughs>